As you thought, the two of them are nowhere to be found. I wonder what could have happened to them. Anyway, let's get back to the surface and look for them. But even if we do, the world's a big place. It's reckless to just go searching blindly. Perhaps the two of them went on a walk? A walk that involves leaving the town without saying anything to us? Not a chance. Well, only the living have the privilege of saying they'll fight to the last breath. And words like conviction and resolve don't mean much to a dead man. Out. Ah, oh, well. Just when things were getting good. Just who are you, anyway? What does the head of the knights want with you? I can't believe I only just remembered that. I've got a bad feeling about this. Hurry! We have to follow them! I understand how you're feeling, but please try to calm down. What? Aren't you worried? Of course I'm worried. That's why we should calm down and think rationally, right? Oh, right. Yeah. I see. I'm sorry. Got any ideas? Ah, yes. The master of Miorzo might have some idea. He's an Entelikea, after all. Maybe he felt the flow of air from the Blastia. Did you hear it? Could you tell us where it was? To the west. A sea of sand. A town? It's not too clear, but a desert town. I think it's Jormgen. That's the town in the sands of Kagor, where we met Duke before. The sands? Why would they go to a place in the middle of nowhere? Let's head there now. You're leaving, then? I am. You don't need to shoulder such a burden. Haven't you suffered enough? Thank you, Elder. But I'm not suffering anymore. Hmm. Hmm. If you went into the outside world, you might understand, too.